Hi everyone, in this video I'll talk about 5 most effective OGS plugins to enhance journal's viewership. The purpose of research journal is to provide uh, re quality research paper and produce information that a researcher policy maker can use. So this is one of the quotations I quote here, information that is not effectively shared with others will not be effectively used. So the purpose of this video is to produce uh, provide uh, five most effective OGS plugins for the journal editors that they can use in their OGS system so that the information which they provide can be used effectively. So first of all I would like to talk about importance of OGS. In OGS is highly flexible user friendly and editor operated journal management and publication system and it provides uh, every stage from submission to final publication to reviewer authors and as well as the edge for editors it has been designed to reduce time and energy and devoted clerical and managerial task for editorial team it also improved the record keeping and efficiency of editorial process so in this video uh, actually this OGS is available in this website and uh, right now most of the journals use OGS PKP OGS more than 10,000 journals are currently using PKP OGS and I'll talk about the plugins plugins allow you OGS to expand its functionality OGS kind of small add-ons are small tools that enhance the OGS uh, functionality and there are tons of plugins available in the OGS and as a journal manager you can decide which plugin to add in your journal most of the common plugins are already available in OGS but there are some certain plugins that can be installed from outside source so in this video I'll talk about five most important plugins that can enhance journal viewership and thus it can enhance journal citation the first is add this add this is actually used to share articles through social media including facebook twitter linkedin uh, gmail yahoo or whatsapp so this plugin provides the uh, this uh, social media sharing for submissions so once this plugin is installed then this icon will be available in the article page so for example this is uh, one of the journals ogs and this is the article published and this is the uh, add this plugins available in this OGS so if reader view reviewer or even author can see then simply he can share on Facebook or Twitter account and then this article will be shared to selected social media pages so this is most important one of the most important because this will increase the viewership and that viewership will increase the uh, citations as well the second important uh, plugin is most read block most read block this shows uh, most read papers in the sidebar so you might have seen this kind of sidebar in the various journals OGS this shows the readers authors and uh, potential authors that what kind of articles has been read it, have been read it for last one month or last one year or last one week its editor can set the setting that if they like top 5 articles, top 10 articles, or last one month articles, best articles, or last one year articles, so they can make settings. And as far as the installation is concerned, about mostly how they can set it, I'll make a separate video, but in this video, I'll just briefly discuss about the 5 most uh, useful plugins. So, this is most read block uh, uh, plugin. The third one is custom block visitor counter this visitor counter you might have seen in a various pages this shows uh, the journal editors that how many visitors visit this page and from which country they belong to this is very good statistics to show the reader uh, to show the uh, journal editor that what kind of people uh, from which country uh, their journal OGS is being viewed for example I install viewership counter and this is how it shows that visitor pk5 and page view 37 
so this once it is installed it will be look like this in the website or web page so the fourth one uh, is a citation format plugins again this is very very useful because most of the scholars or even mphil phd scholars or faculty members has hard time to uh, make a citations so citations format plugins provide user reader with various format in which to access article citations so if a reader or reader or potential author read article from your journal then this will allow that he or she can simply copy it and put in the reference list again it will increase the this will increase the citation as well so this is the example so this is one of the article this is the abstract and this shows how to cite so if a reader read the article and he likes or she likes it simply he or she can copy this and then put in the references so again, this general citations will be increased and this plugin allow various format of citations like APA Chicago MLA whichever uh, the journal decided to uh, allow so there are various settings again I will make a separate video how to install this plugin and how to make settings of those uh, citations format so the fifth and very important is keyword cloud this keyword cloud provides the keyword cloud of article published in the journal again you might have seen this kind of clouds keywords cloud in the journals OGS this again allow reader and the reviewer viewer to see which kind of papers are being published in this journal this will also increase the this will also attract the potential author that for example if I am interested in software and then and this cloud indicate that this journal is have paper related to software have high frequency of paper related to software so this keyword uh, cloud actually the the bigger the word then it shows that they have a high frequency of keywords in the in though in that particular journal for example this is a uh, journal's main page and this is a keyword cloud so once keyword cloud is installed then it will uh, show like this like this but as soon as the time will pass as soon as more publication more issues published by this journal the keyword cloud look like uh, very nice and uh, will be very attractive so this is all from my side these are the five most useful plugins that a journal editor can install so this is the OGS plugin area where the editor can install any plugin simply go to setting go to website under the website there are three plugin uh, three tabs go to the third tab plugins under the plugins there are two further sub tabs install plugin and plugin gallery install plugin has by default install plugins and our editor can enable or disable any plugin so simply for example cloud plugin cloud uh, plugin already installed and enabled most it already installed in plugin and there are others which I already discussed in this video so in a separate video I will show how you can install and make settings of those for plugins and make available for the reader and viewer if you have any question after watching this video please let me know